watching Alaska's News Source. We have an update tonight to our investigation into how an Anchorage charity used a federally funded grant. Revive Alaska Community Services is a local nonprofit organization that received three quarters of a million dollars in COVID relief money back in 2021. Revive told the Anchorage Assembly the money would be used to repair a food pantry in South Anchorage, but it purchased a church instead in, downtown, in Midtown. Meanwhile, the city has released a report evaluating how nonprofits such as Revive utilize those funds. Investigative reporter Mike Mason broke the story and is here now with the latest. Yeah, back in 2021, the Anchorage Assembly was awarded a federal COVID relief grant totaling more than $100 million. They gave that money to dozens of organizations, including Revive, and tonight we know how they claim to have spent that money. In 2021, the city of Anchorage received millions of federal dollars as part of a program called ARPA, which stands for the American Rescue Plan Act. It was designed to help businesses and nonprofits recover from the COVID pandemic. Revive Alaska Community Services received $750,000 to help repair a food pantry in South Anchorage. According to federal guidelines, that money needs to be tracked and accounted for, and each recipient must also prove the funding was used for their intended goals. Revive recently provided an updated report to the city indicating how it spent that money. The group claims it served 50 families per week, distributing approximately 1,500 pounds of food monthly to Anchorage residents. Revive goes on to report, we have also come alongside Alaska school districts to support the child and transition program during this COVID-19 crisis with grocery gift cards. So we contacted the Anchorage School District to see if Revive made donations to them. We're told Revive did contact the district by email in 2020 and provided them with 10 gift cards. But since then, not a single one. That was our first um, awareness that Revive was involved. We had no uh, communication or contact with them prior, and we haven't had any communication or, pro or contact with them since the gift cards were given to us. Uh, the next time that we were became aware of the organization was through your investigative reporting. Um, we haven't had any contact with them since 2020. That information appears to contradict what Revive reported to the city since it did not provide assistance to the Anchorage School District in 2022 or even 2021. And we tried contacting Revive for a comment but haven't heard back. We don't know if Revive donated any gift cards to other school districts, but we should point out grocery gift cards have little to do with the reason Revive was awarded the grant money in the first place, which again was for building a food pantry. Meanwhile, we're told the U.S. Treasury Department is continuing to investigate Revive's use of those ARPA funds. We'll, of course, keep you updated. 